your winery. What do you offer here, Fatima? Here we offer uh, to the tourists uh, some guided tour with wine tasting. They will taste all our wines if they like, and uh, they can enjoy all the wine tour. We present the whole process of uh, winemaking, and uh, they will enjoy it. Three varieties of wine on offer here. Tell me about the white. The white is a white uh, which is made with Viognier, 80%, then Arinto Viognier, it's a dry white. And uh, after we have a rosé. Uh, rosé is made with a bleeding of our grapes and it's quite fruity. It's a lot of strawberry on it. And then you have the reds, which are our uh, two reds, Odoloca and Quinta du Francais. Odolok is the second red. It's uh, the blend of all four varieties we have here. And the top quality Quinta du Francais also. They both stay in French oak barrels and the top quality in some new French oak barrels. Portuguese roots, Fatima Santos. Our vineyard, it's a quite new vineyard. They found this plot of land in 2000. And in 2002, they start planting the vineyard. Our first wine was only produced in 2006, four years after and was quite a small production, 5,000 bottles. At the moment we have a production of 45,000 bottles, 30,000 is from our red varieties and 15,000 for the white wine, but we need to buy the grapes, the cheese to at all. It's alluvium soil and have a lot of water, so on that side we don't need the irrigation system. On that side, the vineyard is close to the, to the river that's passing by, or the local river, also the name from this area. That's why on that side is more cold and more humidity. The grapes on that side are not so concentrated, they are more rich and they also take longer to get mature. So on that side we need another month to do the harvest. Our harvest is everything done by hand, traditional way. We are always around 25-35 people to do the harvest. Always friends, family, neighbors and also clients who come to help us. So you are invited if you want to come next year. <laughs> We're not 100% biologic, but we always try to use as less as possible of chemicals. So um, for you to have one idea in our vineyard, especially in the, uh, in the Algarve, because the weather is quite stable, uh, we use around seven, eight times a year the chemicals. North of Portugal, because the weather is not so stable, they use much more, around 20 times a year. So you can see it's a big difference. After we harvest, we select always our grapes by hand to make sure that we will use the best grapes to the wines. The ones who can be too mature, have some bugs, some leaves, not enough mature, we take them out and we keep them to produce our own compost organic. Also in our vineyard, like you can see, we have mountains all around. So it's a, na a natural protection from, uh, to our vineyard. Keeps some, many disease and many bugs away because usually they also come in the wind but it's quite warm in summertime because we don't get the ocean breeze. Sometimes 42, 45 degrees on our valley, so you can see it's very hard. That's why the harvest is always done in the morning. You have a very small production here. You don't like chemicals and you do as much by hand as you can. Yes, sure. Uh, we have by now 40,000 uh, bottles. Uh, chemicals, as we have a good climate here, we, there is no need to to spray quite a lot on the vineyards, and uh, that's it. And if people come here and they go home very happy. I hope so, <laughs> that's what they say. Thank you very much, Fatima. Thank you.